What's happening YouTube? KGC Epic here. Now, um, I haven't done a YouTube video over the weekend, right? Now, I need to say I'm going to like post up like, I don't know, maybe like five or six videos a day. But I didn't do any over the weekend because, I don't know, I just wasn't into it. I was, I just like, I just needed a break, honestly speaking, from like the recording and stuff. Because I was, I was like doing it like non-stop for like the past month or something, honestly speaking. Um, I don't know, I was on the beach and I was recording a few gaming videos, I was playing some games on my phone and I was recording, right? And I don't know, after I finished recording all the videos that I wanted to record on the beach that day, I just I just didn't even feel to even upload them, I didn't even upload them, I could tell you. Because I just, I just, I don't know, I don't know, I just needed a break, I just didn't feel to do the YouTube thing. So I, I took a break over the weekend and I'm back, I don't know, today's what, Tuesday? Today's Tuesday, because, um... I don't know I didn't do any uh, Monday also so anyways guys um, this video is the life of a youtuber and basically it's just I don't know if it's just YouTube you're doing honestly speaking and you really want to be an active youtuber like a really really active youtuber then yeah it's it's wake up and everything you do you basically want to record honestly speaking now I don't know um for me personally uh when i wake up i don't know i eat breakfast and then the first thing on my mind is just recording the first thing i have on my schedule is all right fine what videos am i going to make for the day what videos am i going to do what videos this what videos that that's basically it for me personally speaking no don't get me wrong it's not even like a task or a chore or anything it's nothing like that right honestly speaking it's really really fun really really invigorating to record youtube especially if you're like me who's just someone who's who's like you know doesn't have doesn't have any work to do in terms of like going out and do a job or anything like that at the end of the day and you have a lot of time home it's really fun honestly and it's a nice it's a nice thing to like just pass time and spend the day even if you don't make money off of youtube because I, I personally don't right honestly speaking i need more subscribers and stuff to start like getting my videos monetized and plus I need more views on my videos honestly speaking so that's why I'm trying to like get my content on my channel up that's why I'm making a lot of YouTube videos and I'm really putting some time into it but honestly speaking like I said when you wake up it's just pre-planned videos if you want to pre-plan honestly sometimes I do on the spot videos like if I'm recording right now and I think of an idea then all my pre-planned videos I do them and then afterwards Sometimes I do on the spot videos. Honestly speaking, I do that. And sometimes you you're out in public and then you see something really cool and then you record it at the end of the day and you know you decide okay fine I'm gonna post it up on YouTube or okay um, I might not post it up on YouTube only I might also post it up on you know Twitter, <coughs> Snapchat whatever at the end of the day you know but honestly speaking for YouTube uh, for your pre-planned well I don't know for me personally for my pre-planned stuff I don't get into like details for my pre-planned stuff what I do for my pre-planned stuff let me see if I can get like a video of this what I do I just write down what topics that I want to do and then I just talk about them honestly I don't even like honestly speaking what I do I don't even um like like see this like this is top coolest ninjutsu like I have a video top coolest ninjutsu in Naruto right and then I just write down what I think the top coolest jutsus are and then I just like elaborate on it. I don't write down everything that I'm going to say, right? At the end of the day. But you know, that's just that's just how it is, right? For me personally. But I know for some YouTubers they probably like script their stuff, which is okay also, you know. But for me personally, I don't get into that stuff. I don't like to overcomplicate like me doing YouTube. I always say that and that that's one thing I used to do before, that's why I quitted YouTube prior, right? And I didn't even get like the amount of views and stuff and publicity and stuff that I should have gotten when I really started YouTube a few years ago honestly speaking because I don't know I used to overcomplicate it because sometimes I record a video and I don't know simply because I don't know the video like I don't know if a game lagged once throughout an entire 15 minute gameplay I never used to post it up because I said I don't want any videos with lags and stuff and these days I don't really fucking care I don't, honestly and most people that watch videos like that don't really fucking care and that's just reality right um like, okay like uh, sometimes like if like how i used to play smite right like how i just started there like prior to like how i'm doing youtube now when i just started to do youtube if i was talking and i was stuttering i would like redo it sometimes 20 times i would redo it just to try to get a perfect perfect video and then sometimes you realize that 
you're so tired in front of the camera that you can't really be genuine after trying to redo a video 20 times right um and like even if like i'm playing smite like i said like a smite game plays like 20 minutes 15 minutes like you know that's a really really long fucking time you know like let's say we have one lag in the game at the end of the day it's something like don't post it up at the end of the day you know and that that sort of stuff that that's like over complicating it right even the editing like i used to over complicate my editing too like i used to do like a whole bunch of song, song tracks and background music annotations all that sort of stuff i don't even do that stuff anymore honestly speaking like you, you realize that very few people use that sort of stuff honestly th these are just youtube ideas just to that you know the actual like you know managers of YouTube just implemented just to keep YouTube lively at the end of the day so people could say that they're not lazy or whatever honestly speaking I personally have never used annotations outside of actually putting annotations in my video honestly speaking I have never used like uh, the fast forward button or changing uh, how much the frame rate of a video how much pixels are in a video I've never done this stuff honestly speaking in a YouTube video honestly speaking when I'm actually on YouTube to watch videos and not to actually upload videos and you know so that's that's like stuff that I I used to always like incorporate or try to do and all that sort of stuff at the end of the day you know but right now I'm not even doing that shit so I don't even over complicate YouTube anymore so honestly speaking like I said it depends honestly because for me personally it's just sitting outside here sometimes for like an hour two hours a day and doing like maybe four or five videos whereas for some people it might be like all day they're editing right so it depends it depends on what kind of youtuber you are at the end of the day and sometimes the edited videos aren't necessarily better than the more genuine videos because right now everyone is trying to go live and you can't edit live right so all the editors and all that sort of stuff at the end of the day you know everyone's doing it live right now so no one really fucking cares about sitting down for like two three hours just editing videos at the end of the fucking day i mean don't get me wrong sometimes i do a few edits but nothing big at the end of the day right most of my videos are just straight record at the end of the day but honestly for life of a youtuber it's just chilling back thinking of a few videos coming up with like really awesome ideas honestly speaking i don't really run out of ideas when it comes to youtube i have like 280 videos on my channel thus far right and i'm not, nowhere close to running out of ideas when it comes to youtube like i could just sit down and it literally takes me in about five minutes to come up with like ideas for youtube honestly speaking and when it comes to uploading videos i don't even like upload videos when i'm up honestly I just put them to upload and just go to bed that's all I do honestly speaking so it's really cool it's really really awesome honestly speaking I would recommend you all try another whole YouTube thing honestly speaking because like I said it doesn't change your day honestly speaking or if anything it changes your day for the best because honestly when you when you, when you want to record something you find yourself actually doing stuff for the day like before I started YouTube I never used to leave the fucking house I used to just stay home whole day honestly and just game like a fucking beast i used to just play some serious fucking games honestly that's what i used to do whole day but now i find myself going on the beach i find myself going jogging i find myself doing a whole bunch of other fucking stuff you know and you know only because like sometimes i want to record certain things on the beach i go on the beach sometimes because the beach is really cool it's a really nice place to record it's really awesome it's always fucking awesome on the beach honestly speaking you know and that's sort of shit at the end of the day like i have a few videos that i don't even write down like a few titles that i don't even write down and i just have in the back of my head just to do at the end of the day that's just how awesome it is but honestly life of a youtuber is awesome now i'm an unpaid youtuber right so i can't give you the life of a paid youtuber i would i would think that the life of a paid youtuber is way more awesome at the end of the day because that's going to be like you just uploading a video and you're getting mad cash and literally anything that you want to buy you could buy it from a youtuber salary honestly speaking so that's going to be more awesome but i'm going to think that they're pretty similar except one is just paid and one is unpaid honestly speaking but i could be wrong because honestly speaking the money that you get from youtube is really fucking heavy i must say so but you know that's just how it is but like i said it's awesome to be a youtuber at the end of the day a really active one and you know if at the end of the day you guys want to try out youtube 
you guys don't need anything big to try at YouTube at the end of the day. Like, I just do YouTube on my Android phone, honestly speaking. That's all I do YouTube on right now. And I'm able to upload hundreds of videos, honestly speaking. So you guys could just try out something at the end of the day. And then you realize that you'll get into it. Like, when I just started on YouTube, I used to be kind of weird and I put it front of the camera sometimes, honestly speaking. But that was like way, way, way before. Like I said, that was like before I quitted YouTube. That's why like when I started YouTube and uh, I was doing like a whole bunch of smite videos and um, I don't know, I was doing like a whole bunch of indie games, honestly speaking. Those, those were the kind of games you, you would like see on my uh, YouTube channel if you like date back, honestly speaking. But right now, I'm doing a lot of Android games right now. and. I'm doing like a lot of like videos like these where I'm just sitting on the porch just talking about various topics um, and sometimes I do like on the beach vlogs and stuff like that at the end of the day you know but honestly speaking like I said you don't have to follow what people post up on YouTube not because people do gaming you have to do gaming but I do gaming right not because you see people do like vlogs you have to do vlogs whatever you want to do just do it and don't don't don't, don't even think about what people are going to think about the video or whatever just post it up and you guys might see something awesome at the end of the day like i said you don't know what is going to happen until it fucking happens so just do it at the end of the day a youtuber's life is awesome at the end of the day like i said it's really awesome to record stuff it's really awesome to shoot videos at the end of the day you, you learn that when you're shooting videos then you know i don't know i don't know it's just a type of vibe at the end of the day that is just really different it makes you more charismatic as an individual also i'm more open as a person because you're always shooting these videos and then uploading it to the public so you always realize that you as an individual you know you, you tend to be you know more social in general on honestly speaking not just on social media but in the public like like you know physically in real life honestly speaking and you know th these are really good fucking enhancements in your life honestly speaking i must say that the youtuber life is pretty decent it's pretty awesome so you know be sure to check out my channel be sure to like share and subscribe but as usual stay awesome um like i said over the past like three or four days i don't have any new videos up but i do have all the videos you guys can check out and plus the videos that i'm going to be uploading today i have like about 10 videos to upload for you guys today honestly speaking so honestly it's going to be really really awesome so you know uh, stay tuned for more stuff. Check out my stuff. Be sure to hit that subscribe button guys. I need those subscribers right now. I got 41 subscribers and I want more at the end of the day. And as usual, stay epic people.